Every November is marked by arrival of edible grasshoppers known as insenene. These insects are a delicacy, especially in central Uganda. The grasshopper business was very lucrative and many from the region can account for the benefits. But due to climate changes, grasshopper breeding patterns are changing. Many who had planned to have vest grasshoppers this month have waited in vain. The situation is good for the grasshoppers to come, but unfortunately there is nothing we are getting. Throw almost 300,000 and the iron sheets, they are so expensive, the barubs, they get to brown every day, every day, that you have to repress them. The season is challenging for sure. What we expected is not what we are seeing. However, according to weather experts at the Uganda National Meteorological Authority, above average rains are currently ongoing in the country, was predicted. We issued the, uh, a seasonal forecast for September, October, November, including December, where we, uh, we want the country that we, ex we expecting to have a renewal rains. Uh, getting rains which are more than the ones which we usually get, which we call the uh, above normal rains. The authority spokesperson Yusuf Nsubuga says this explains the scarcity of the grasshoppers. And these grasshoppers, they lay their eggs uh, under the soil, in the soil. So when they lay their eggs in the soils, now here comes a lot of rain, which, which uh, increases the soil moisture. And when the moisture in the soil increases, it means that the, the temperature, the soil temperatures will be lower than the, the suitable temperatures that can help in the hatching of the eggs of these grasshoppers. They are having a lot of rains as was expected in this season. Hence, uh, leading to affecting the hatching of the eggs of these grasshoppers. And that is why we are having uh, reduced uh, numbers of grasshoppers. The matter is of little consideration for the lovers of the delicacy who have developed all sorts of myth on where they breed. That they, they come from the soil. So you don't expect the, these eggs to be hatched. Instead they will just rot into the soil and hence reduce the numbers of grasshoppers. So we expect them to come from Fort Porto, isn't it? Kasese, even Masaka here. And then the point is, at those places getting uh, heavy rains, the answer is yes. But the weather experts say there is still hope for the grasshopper lovers in the near future. The rain is now there in their peak, peak months. So as we move towards uh, December, we expect them to reduce in amounts. And the, uh, we might start getting some, seeing some grasshoppers, so, uh, but not as much as we expect. Jingo Francis, NTV.